Hi, my name is Anika and my team's name is Coder Girls. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Ria and I'm from the team Coder Girls. Assalamu alaikum, I am Najifa Anjum from team Coder Girls. Our app name is Lostis. Our app is mainly related to law and justice. So, we name the Lostis, which is the combination of law and justice. We believe that every single person has that opportunity to be treated with the kindness, compassion, fairness and empathy that they deserve. Injustice is the lack of voice and the lack of opportunity. According to a 2015 survey by the Bangladesh Bureau of Statistics and the United Nations Population Fund, over 70% of married women or girls in Bangladesh have faced some form of intimate partner abuse. About half of them say their partners have physically assaulted them. In Bangladesh, 40% of the women are victims of physical violence. Violence against women and girls are increasing day by day. As example, in March and April of 2019, where 255 women and girls were victim of violence, in March and April of 2020, it stood up to 431. That means it's double. Violence against women and girls in Bangladesh appears to have further increased during the COVID-19 pandemic, with NGO hotlines reporting a rise in distrust calls. During the pandemic, 141 women were murdered by husbands and 115 women had to face sexual harassment. According to another proximate Bangladesh Women's Rights Group named Odhikar mentioned that between January 2001 and December 2019, over 3,300 women and girls were murdered over dowry disputes. Most of the lawyers in our country don't get enough clients because the clients either hesitate to share their problems or to file a case. But now, by our app, the clients can hire professional lawyers and the lawyers can get clients easily. As many people don't know about law that much, so they can consult with professional lawyers to our app. This way they can get ideas about what they should do to solve their problems and they won't be misled by others using our app. People will be more cautious about justice and law, besides lawyer can easily contact with their clients through our app. Our app users have to give a minimum fee to consult with lawyers and we are going to keep some commission from the lawyer's profit. So mainly both users and lawyers are going to be benefited. Lawyers can earn and users can get service. Our plan is to work with Bangladesh law agencies and spread it all over the country. We want to help the Bangladesh government through our app. Our future plan and initiatives are to add more new features in our app. We have a plan to add an option where people can easily file a complaint sitting at home through our app. But for this, we need the help of Bangladesh government and Bangladesh police. Another feature we want to add is whenever someone is in trouble, they can click on the emergency button of our app and their location will be tracked by the nearest police station and the police will reach there in a short time to help them. In conclusion, our app is to help those who fear raising their voice against injustice. As a result, crimes keep on increasing in our country. We want to make it easier to raise their voice through our app. Besides, lawyers will be benefited too. We want to upgrade our app in the future and help the people of our country, mainly girls and women, to fight for justice.